Hi everyone, how are y'all doing? How's it going? How's it going? Hi, 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 hi. Someone says they're still asleep. Same, my friend. I hope you have some coffee or some caffeine to get you through the day. Good morning, everyone. It's Taylor. Hello. How are you all doing? This has been like my third week in a row. Oh, is this loud? No, it's fine. Okay, I'm just, I'm just crazy. It's cool. Anyway, it's been my third week in a row where I've been streaming. So I, it's like, this is a normal week for me now. This is very, very fun. Howdy from Texas. Yeehaw. I love Texas. I just live everywhere. That isn't my apartment. <laughs> that isn't where I currently live. You're, you're telling me you're outside the four walls that I have subjected myself to? I would love to go there. But yeah, Texas is beautiful. From Pittsburgh. Medium, medium opinions about Pittsburgh. I, I, I nothing Pittsburgh. I don't think about it, but hello. I'm sure it's beautiful there. <laughs> Someone says they're from Kentucky. I love Kentucky. I love your fried chicken. My Warframe kind of looks like Goldar. Oh, I have a Goldar figure, but it's all the way in the basement. But thank you. I really appreciate that compliment. <laughs> I'm gonna take it. I don't know if it's intended as a compliment, but I I will take it. It's. I wish I could get it, but I'm not gonna walk down like three flights of stairs. Anyway, uh, I swear. <laughs> 45 ducats, exactly. Listen, my friend. You're just watching, it's free. I don't I don't understand. I'm not gonna complain if I go to a pizza place and they're like, anyone with the name Taylor gets a free pepperoni pizza and be mad because it doesn't have, like, am I gonna talk about pizza toppings that I like or are people gonna get mad at me? Black olives, is this gross? Pineapple? Anyway, I'm not gonna be mad if it's just a slice of pepperoni because like, I'm not gonna say no to free pizza. Pizza's pizza. Pizza, pizza. Duckets are duckets. Anyway. That's just my two cents. Anyway, I know olives are <laughs> olives are one of those things that's like you either hate them or you love them. But I like Subway sandwiches, olives, pizza, olives by themselves, olives. Love it. Anyway, pineapple, pineapple on pizza is good. Come at me. Pineapple on burgers, also fan uh, fantastic. There's a place that has like really fancy burgers and one of them has like it had pineapple. I think it was Australian. It had like pineapple beet and egg and that sounds disgusting, but there's something about it that was really tasty and it was probably the fact that it was a giant burger that was covered in grease but anyway <laughs> someone's saying i don't like guacamole i love guacamole i just like guacamole without cilantro chili sauce on chocolate i could see it like th isn't that like a thing like you can get mexican hot chocolates that has like chili powder i put like people put chocolate in their their actual chili so i don't know and there's like that whole thing where like people put chocolate on chicken. If someone can make it work, why not, right? <laughs> this stream is making me so hungry right now. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay. All right. <laughs> we can change topics. Although, listen, if you're hungry after like listening to people talking about like how much <laughs> like, you know, kind of hot topic food opinions, then I'll all more power to you. That's that's great. <laughs> Pretty sure chocolate increases the spiciness of chilies. Yeah, that makes sense. Again, this is gonna be one of those moments where I'm like, yeah, someone told me this is a fact and I'm gonna tell people from now on that chocolate increases the spices of chilies based off of one Twitch comment. And if someone tells me I'm wrong, I'm gonna blame you from, <laughs> from here on out. But whatever, we'll just, we're just hitting things. Yorkshire puddings and jam. I've never had a good Yorkshire pudding in my life, but that's probably because I live in Canada and we have fake British food. But I'm sure that's delicious. I'll tell you one thing though, Jaffa cakes, not good. I'm sorry. Is this, am I allowed to be saying this? Am I, I, I I'm gonna, I'm gonna get like DMs from Reb after this. She's gonna be like, Taylor, <laughs> you're not allowed to say things that will upset people. I'm sorry. Anyway, real British food is still fake. <laughs> British food though, wow. Uh, Blitz, I can't say the, the, the rest of your name, but damn. That's an opinion. That's an opinion. <laughs> uh, I think it's an expectation thing, right? It's like when you like go. <laughs> Why did my brain go here? But it's like when you know you you see some vanilla pudding and it turns out that someone actually swapped it with mayonnaise or something. It's like when you expect something like just to be pure chocolate and then like it has orange in it. I swear, I hope I'm talking about the right thing. But like, I think I just didn't expect Jaffa Cakes to taste the way that they did. So maybe if I have them again, knowing what they are, it'll be okay. You know what I mean? 
No, I do not. I do not eat mayo like pudding. I was just thinking, like, someone was talking about doing a prank. I don't know where this was on the internet, but they were talking about, like, eating vanilla pudding out of a mayo jar or something. Like, just one of those pranks that, that everyone does, you know. Anyway, blue Gatorade and a Windex bottle. Listen, I don't know how many times, no matter how many times you clean out that Windex bottle, I don't think it'll be safe to drink out of. But listen, if that's what you want to do with your life, if that's how you want to go out, salute to you, my friend. <laughs> she probably gets a hate mail <laughs> like a mail i could see it i'm the like you know i have i nothing mail like i like mail i i have no i have no real opinions about mail i don't know but i heard that miracle whip is also a hot hot topic that people hate so there you go <laughs> don't use cleaning bottles for drinks that is a really good example i'm the kind of person where like i don't cross-contaminate cleaning products at all so like i remember again working at mcdonald's and having the manager being like if you mix ammonia and bleach you can die and so now i'm like if i mix anything it could have ammonia or bleach in it and i could die so recycle your windex bottles by using them as drink bottles perfect <laughs> disgusting the really cool thing about that is like if you don't want to use like straws right you can just like spray it in your mouth <laughs> I, don't, I don't know I don't know I don't know <laughs> this is why I shouldn't stream more than twice a month because I <laughs> lose topics to talk about and then we just talk about this instead and it's a mistake every time. <laughs> disclaimer do not do anything that i say on stream because <laughs> it's the dumbest thing <laughs> uh, oh taylor died in front of 20 gay people Ex exactly goodness uh. <laughs> goodness gracious scrambled eggs is made by gordon ramsay that is like one of the first youtube videos i ever like put in my favorites playlist as a kid i remember watching that over and over and over again it's a classic and then I've never made them. <laughs> never made them the way that he makes them. But I watched that video probably ten times. <laughs> oh boy. Why do I talk? Why do I mention things? Let's just talk about Warframe, huh? Um <laughs> <laughs> no frame chef for your listen okay lavos is like you know he's like the alchemist but if you actually had like a chef or like cooking themed warframe i would cry of happiness huh that would be so cool they could like throw butcher knives and then like i don't know like the their the ultimate could just be like you turn the floor into a giant grill and then like flames shoot up through it that'd be cool i'm here for it i don't know what the lore is for <laughs> that supports it but i really don't care <laughs> because that would be super fun and like you could have like spaghetti <laughs> spaghetti <laughs> just spaghetti <laughs> but like yeah <laughs> i'm so sorry <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like like hydroids, uh, tentacles, or like, I mean, calamari could fit that as well instead. But like, I was thinking like ensnare, but it's spaghetti instead. I don't know. And then the and then you could have one where like you just summon Jello, and then uh, it's like CC, right? It's kind of like how you glass the enemies with Gara's four. <laughs> and then something happens if you pick it up. I don't know. There's a reason why um, Pablo and other people design Warframes, and I am not part of that conversation. But <laughs> what is what is the stream anymore? I don't know. I don't know. Like genuinely, um, 
I don't know why they let me keep doing these. That's the real, that's the real question. <laughs> Frost no globe is a salt shaker, yes. You put too much sodium and then they die. <laughs> and then the next mission that they go to, they die of heart disease. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> we're supposed to talk about Warframe. We are talking about Warframe. We're talking about a Warframe that's a chef that kills its enemies by feeding them really unhealthy food. You know, that's how you take the grenier down from the inside, right? Like, yeah, you can just kill them in missions, but really, you gotta get, <laughs> gotta get to the core and kill them with unhealthy habits. Ah, reverse, it's like reverse Grendel. Grendel is like, you know, the one that eats everyone, but this is the, the one that feeds everyone. Anyway, <laughs> playing the long game, right? That's what I'm saying. It's like, we've been thinking short term, but we gotta think long term strategy here. Clearly what we're doing isn't working. Anyway. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Taylor says sleep to five. No, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> I'm okay, I'm okay, no problem. It's just, it's just funny. That's all. I just think I'm hilarious, and so that's the issue. Is now I have a bunch of people watching me laugh at my own jokes. <laughs> uh, anyway, that's it for me today. It's 11:02. I've I've done I've done my job. I'm I apologize for everything. Genuinely, I don't know what happened today. We were talking about drinking stuff out of a, a Windex bottle and. S spaghetti and snares. I don't know. I genuinely have no idea. Uh, and so this is my formal apology. <laughs> but thank you so much for hanging out with me. <laughs> I had fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it a little bit, even if it maybe scratching your noggin a little bit as it goes. <laughs> I've done my job and I am so sorry for it. <laughs> have a fantastic rest of your week, my friends. Take care. Be kind to each other. Have a good one. Bye.